my <coughs> okay. All right. As dark falls, you do find a spot that's yeah, somewhat defensible. It's nestled between the forks of a small stream. Okay. The only thing you hear is the uh, plotting the work of small woodland animals. What you'll have is throughout the night, occasionally you hear a splash. I assume you're on first watch. I'm on, no. I'd probably actually take first. Yeah, you're on first with Elspeth. You two hear a splash throughout the entire night, every about three or four minutes. You can't overturn we were hearing this before everybody else went to bed too. What? We were hearing this before everybody else went to bed too. I look in the general direction, I hear the splash, and I see nothing. <laughs> okay. He sees something. Assuming five does nothing. Yeah. Yeah. Go check. I don't think it's before we go to bed, we hear it, you said. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the perception is a 16, probably not doing shit. Okay. 24. All right. All you can really tell is that there's an area trafficked by beavers. Okay. Lots and lots and lots of beavers. There's after about an hour. After a full hour, what you're going to discover is that there's a little area dammed up about 50 foot downstream where they've got it dammed up. And there's three beavers that seem to work service that area. Uh, seem to be more of a situation where you have two adults, one last runt, and still alive. Okay. Not a problem. Just the splashes are beavers working in the area. Now, as the evening progresses, the watches go by uneventfully. When I say uneventfully, I mean. To the point where. If I heard that, if I would have gone and killed him to eat some beaver. I'll need you guys to make. Why not? If you're on watch. I want to eat some beaver. No. I need a 14 on your wisdom check if you're going to try to stay awake. Otherwise, the sound of the water going over the rocks and over the logs. <clears throat> wisdom 14, otherwise, you pass wisdom out. Wisdom or will? Wisdom. Cool. Wis Wils you Wils said wisdom. Wisdom. If you're on watch, wisdom. that's everyone. I got 17, so I didn't have to. Okay. 19 on the dot. Okay. 15 on my dice. 14 on mine. 14. Wow. Total. Apparently, I stay away from the first watch. He falls asleep. <laughs> oh no, 14. Asleep. 14 is up. 14 is what I ask. You didn't get a 14. I rolled a six. Okay. He falls asleep. She. She falls asleep. <laughs> it. The one of the quarter. <laughs> <laughs> it at this point. She falls asleep. Okay. <laughs> you can't tell it's supposed to happen. Turn out the tree. <laughs> We're just not going to change the pizza right now. Can you operation? Alright. Why is there a little bug? Over the course of the... No, it's your on second watch. Oh, I'm on second watch. Oh, it's Zach and I'll see her. Yeah. I'll let him sleep. Funny splatter. Yeah. I'll let her sleep. I'll let it sleep. I said it right. I'll let it sleep. It's a no. They're all referred to as it. This is basically shut them up. Well, I'm an elf, so yeah, everything else is considered an it. Alright, who's on third watch? I could do it. But it's just and like a... Tedious. Baldrick and no. Thanos figuring out the pattern Everybody make a perception check. Okay. Well, not on that watch. On the watch. Mm -hmm. 27. 27. Okay. Am I doing this? What's going nope. On? You're asleep. You're asleep. Oh. Yay. You two hear the snapping of twigs. 25. You hear the snapping of twigs. You're asleep. Third watch? Oh. Third watch? <laughs> I thought it was on. No. He, it's Thanos. Like the ring. Baldrick and Baldrick. Baldrick. You're on second watch. Oh. The actual. Yeah. Wow. Snapping of twigs. Which direction? Behind you guys. Okay. Yes. You go and investigate. Oh, fuck you. Like, <laughs> stay here, I'll go over there. Head over, try to use stealth. I did? Would you rather me do that? Can I actually hide? Oh. Oh, what's yours? Better than yours? 14. Maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> I can... 20 total. Okay. <coughs> You, uh, you see footprints. Can't tell who's though. Survival check. Okay, and that's gonna be a plus two to that. Twenty nine. That was like a bad horse. Somebody's wearing Brevik make leather boots. 
somebody is wearing Brevik make leather boots that's of a small size. Okay. Somebody small has been following us. Midgets! From Brevik. No, not Kiki. Kiki's Shoot. way burning. Midgets? No, I said midgets. She was over at the witch's house. Yeah, but Kiki, but Kiki she goes would be barefoot. barefoot or either have, have an animal footprint. Mm. What? The half Druid. Fling. No, no. An animal footprint, though? Oh, well, she, she's a druid. She, she can wild shape. Oh, okay. All of a sudden, as you guys are well, but listening I, for I, I him, you're listening for Pablo to poke that his head out. be the precise reason why okay. I wouldn't have sex with her. She had a lot of shit. Just count set. Be, yeah. Two. <laughs> Two sets. Two sets. Small. Both. Okay, I'll head back. You hear a voice. Nervous. Pablo. <laughs> Do I recognize the voice? Yep. Wait, what, what did you make Sounds like Jubilost. What did you make that? Um, Stuck him up. Okay, yes. Jubilost is your gnomish marshal. He adventures throughout the un undeveloped areas of your kingdom. Okay. I didn't realize you guys were over here. It was invested. Yeah. I've been investigating the situation over here. Past three days, we've been hunting a pair of trolls. He speaks in full volume, but away from the camp, so nobody that's sleeping hears this. Right. Okay. Nice. Nice. I was belching all last, all, all on the camera two weeks ago. You'll be watching video and you're. Anyway, I don't know. I think I think I should replace my guy with my ogre, just so we know who it is. Well, I'm pretty certain there's another pewter figs out there. Dear God, man! <laughs> I'm a guy named Jubilos. Why would I not have an ogre piece? Seriously? Jubilos tells you he's like, I've been, tr we've been tracking trolls through this area for a while. We've been having a lot of unconfirmed reports down here. Yeah, there were. You guys got the rest of them? Yeah, we, we took out, I think it was Apparently they weren't of watching them. us walk around because I'm wearing a, you know, a troll skull. We took out about 19 of them. It's, it's going to need to cure for a day or two. You can't wear it yet. You could, but there's risk of infection. And lots uh, of still, I'd still be carrying it around like this. Yes. If, if you really want to have fun with this, yeah, we could say you put it on. Just, just like leather, you have to let it cure. Well, I thought it's been like a day, though, because I... You're going to cure for a few days. About a week. Alright. Interesting, it's about a week for curing leather and stuff like that. <laughs> yeah, but... Is that the one making fun. boots? What are you looking so, for, Robert? It's something different. Though. The yeah, paper I had with all the different like, positions that we had filled. <coughs> Jubilost is just your marshal, that's all he does. Okay. Yeah, I wish I could find the paper. DM to viewers. Make sure your player characters either save it on a smartphone or have it on a tablet. They never forget to bring with them. Also, There's don't let, don't let your players come in without a character sheet. Hello, gamer bag. All right. Good board. This is useful. I have a book in here. I has sheets. There it is. I have dice. I have pencils. No, he wasn't so much. It's everything you need. What and a calculator he? for people to get at. Nothing on there right now. Or or a tired uh, player. I can. <laughs> Didn't we discuss me being a marshal? I don't think we had really talked to him about that. Well, that you're not going to keep me in the walls of your damned city. You're not going to keep me within the building confines of any place either. <clears throat> while, we, while I've got you here, I might as well put the offer up to you. I want to be the marshal for your kingdom. Okay. I have no problem with that. It'll help you guys out, plus the fact it'll give you guys some advanced warning. I know this area a little bit better than most. Now to the west, there's some pretty voracious predators, about the size of a troll hound. Okay. You ever hear of a hodag before? Yeah, we were. We're going to take care of those. Go and try to take care of those. Okay. It's like, what you need to do is just corner them. They're in a, a little bit of a, I guess you'd say, an alcove. Hill rises around it, cave okay. goes in, <coughs> about four of them there total. Thank you for the information. Don't let them shake you. 
Thank you for the information. Oh, okay. numbers. All right. I'll never try to get them. Those numbers are useful. And so, you know, oh, we have trolls down there. Trolls? Yeah. How many trolls could there be? Oh, not that many. The trolls. Nineteen bloody trolls. <laughs> they were fifth level during that fight. I just have to say that in pride. <laughs> I like numbers. Yeah. Okay. okay. Once we finish this area, then we'll head yeah, over there. All right. The next two days will pass uneventfully. You guys will have another hex, and everybody gets 25 XP.